Right, so this is a video on how to take apart these 33 round magazines from Glock. There's no videos on YouTube or good explanations on the Glock forums. You'll need a, um, a punch. I have a drill bit wrapped in electrical tape, a wrench of some type or a vise, and either duct tape, paper, or some type of cloth to wrap around your magazine so it doesn't get marred. Start by wrapping your magazine in whatever you're gonna use to hold in the vise. Wrap the vise around. Do not push on it yet. Place your punch inwards into the hole. Squeeze. I heard that click. You don't want it to click. You want it to be captured by the inside of it. Okay. Now you can see I started removing it. And the vice grip. And make sure to place your fingers over the I didn't clear it all the way, so I'll just push in, outwards, in, and outwards, there you go, you can see the base plate right there. So then, cover with your finger, and remove, if you don't, this will come flying out, it's under a lot of tension. Oh, here we go. So, you take the spring out, take the follower out, that won't be so hard without a riveted magazine. A standard magazine, place your spring inside the follower like this, so it's aimed upwards with the tail towards this side. And on riveted magazines, first drop the follower into the magazine and orient it correctly. There we go, okay. So once it's in place, insert your magazine spring with this part going towards this side. So this goes upwards like this. Push the magazine back in and get past the rivet. and make sure the follower is captured. You can tell it's captured because you have magazine tension there. And then to reassemble, this over, going this way. And push inwards. And always keep your finger over it or it's gonna fly away. So there's two slotted rails for it to go into, like here, that correspond to there. I'll place through. And keep pushing until you hear the click. That's the click. And there you go. That's how you reassemble the 33 round with the plus two extension on it magazine.